So the next step is I'm going to get myself a nice email address. I'm not going to go get a, um, well, I'm just looking at my domain, um, altcurrencyearnersclub.com, adjacent at altcurrencyearnersclub.com. I'm just going to get like altcurrencyearnersclub at gmail.com. So that way, any correspondence, any emails can go through that. In the future, if I want to get fancy and pay the three to five dollars per month, to uh, be able to have that domain if it's worth it uh, that that email address um, i will get it so let's get that sorted and um, head over so i'm heading over to my email and i'm going to be going add account this is a very straightforward uh, uh, choice more options uh, create account I'm just going to put my name, Jason Cohen, and then I'm going to give it Alt Currency Earners Club, club at gmail.com. Spelt wrong. Alt Currency Earners Club dot com. Let's double check that. I'm going to cheat. I'm just going to grab that. Make sure it's 100% correct. You never know one word and I look ridiculous. There we go and put in a password. Always like to put in my real date of birth, hate to admit it as I'm getting older. Uh, 28, 1976 and uh, mail. And yes, you will have my phone number. If you want to contact me, you now know what it is. <laughs> And I'm going to put in my my current email, and, and you have my personal email as well. So, should you need to send any advice, you know now, know now how to contact me. And there we go. Uh, All currency earners club at gmail.com. Next step. So this just basically helps me to be organised. I can um, show you. Um, you'll see in the next step. The reason for setting up an email address is that we're going to use q.com um, as one of one of the possible choices to start to get people to uh, we'll get to start to get content added to the page and I can't do that through my main email address because it's it uh, is basically set up so in the next video I'm going to show you q dot com and you'll see why.